Hey guys, it's Tyler over at Roanoke Island Fitness Lab and we're coming at you with your workout of the day. Um, today we've got it set up a little bit differently. We're going to start with a buy-in of 50 air squats. After you've done your air squats, we're going to get to the meat of the workout today. Um, we're going to do 10 decline push-ups, 20 sit-ups, 20 regular push-ups, 20 sit-ups again, and then we'll do 30 incline push-ups. Um, the push-ups will actually get easier as you go through, um, and then you'll repeat that one second time all the way through, and then you'll do your cash out, which again will be 50 air squats. Hey, I'm Justin here at Roanoke Island Fitness Lab. I'm gonna talk about the workout. So your air squats, just make sure that your chest stays up. You're gonna squat all the way down, hips below parallel, and then stand all the way up. So keeping that chest up, squat down, and up. Down, up. All right, hey guys, it's Tyler. I'm gonna show you the decline push-up. Um, I'm gonna use a box for this, but if you're at home, you can use your couch, you can use a chair. What you're gonna do is just place your feet up. You're gonna to wanna to make sure that your hips are tucked and your back is flat. Your hands are gonna be underneath your shoulders, and you're gonna go down and up. Down and up. All right, for your sit-up, if you have an ab mat or you can fold up a towel or anything just to kind of give you a little support there, all right, you can go all the way down, shoulders touch the back. You're gonna sit up where your hips come all the way up, touch the floor in front of you, all the way up. All the way down, all the way up. You're put the regular push up right there in the middle. All right, same thing as Tyler told you before, your um, hands right underneath your shoulders, you're gonna squeeze your butt, squeeze your thighs, all the way down, chest touches the ground, and then you'll push up. Try to keep those elbows back and push up. If you need to, you can go to your knees, push down, up. All right, that's your regular push-up. All right, for the last set of push-ups, it's gonna be an incline push-up. What you're gonna do is reverse of the very first one, so your hands are actually gonna go on the couch or on that chair this time. If you are doing it up against the chair, maybe you wanna push the chair up against the wall just so that it doesn't slide out from underneath you while you're going. Um, again, make sure that you stack yourself, you go down, and up, down, and up.